How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Caswell Customs. Vinny here. We got Paul. Later, we got Tim coming over. And today, we are installing something that's gonna make this trailer so much more comfortable. So uh, we talked about it last video, but we're gonna start taking down the ceiling. We're gonna install our AC unit up here. So, you know, I know it's a cargo trailer, but you know, we built it to be kind of our camper, so we want it to be comfortable. So the AC unit's in the garage. Go ahead and show you that real quick, and then we're gonna start taking the ceiling down. This is our Furion rooftop AC unit. Got it off Amazon for 600 bucks. Um, it's 14,500 BTU, so should be able to cool down that trailer no problem. So, literally started raining, so not going to get that on the roof just yet. It's only supposed to pass through real quick. So we're going to go ahead and get the ceiling cooled down and get this thrown up there. So, check it out. Eyes in the sky, gazing far into the night. I raise my hand to the fire. But it's no use, cause you can't stop it from shining through It's true, baby let the light shine through If you believe it's true, baby won't you let the light shine through For you All right, so I kind of really failed at recording all this part. We just got, you know, started getting into it, and it was hot, muggy. We were up on the roof. It was wet. It, it wasn't good. So I'm gonna just kind of catch up on what we got done. We didn't film, um, and then I'm gonna be better about filming this moving forward. But uh, so let's check it out. Um, so we uh, trust all of this roof section, the two by fours. And then we also did this section. Also did this section uh, inside of the railing, so it's just a thicker point. Then we trust everything together. And then we got the interior in there. Uh, we had to bring the roof down in order to have the right gap. So there's supposed to be at least a three to six inch gap. So now we have the right gap um, so that our bolts would tighten. Um, so now, let me show you the outside. So we got the unit up there on the roof. Uh, it's, uh, it's real nice up there. What I'm working on is running some wire 
for the uh, thermostat. So running it through this old hole that used to be where there was uh, like a weird light switch that went nowhere. Just uh, screw that on there, ran it behind all there, up, and through that gap over there. So, um, so the uh, wires all ran through, which is real nice. The insulation's almost all back in. So almost got everything back together. Um, so now we're just gonna start getting the roof back on and uh, hopefully we'll be able to test this thing out here soon. We are still waiting on one more part. We're waiting on the Furion zone controller. And that's what uh, all this stuff is uh, gonna get wired into and the unit actually gets plugged into. So we're gonna get that uh, here in the next day. Hopefully get that on Thursday and then we leave for the sand dunes on Friday. Drinks milk and showers together. <laughs> well. <laughs> Tim, have you ever seen Always Sunny in Philadelphia? Nope. Okay then. Chill your tits, bro. It's like I've been trapped in the drive all day. So you are taking this off? Yeah, right? we're just going to cut and take this off. Right. Not, we'll find a different way to trim. Can't you just it? use your oscillating saw? That's what I'm going to do. Oh, okay. Literally right in front of the camera. Okay. But like Tim said, you keep saying router. <laughs> router, oscillating to the Not even a I know it's not. Yeah, no, he's definitely right. In the video. <laughs> yeah, whatever I say. He, he, whatever he says goes. <laughs>
to give the illusion that everything's put together right now. <laughs> Huh. So I wonder why they were wearing different clothes when they said that it's working. <laughs> <laughs> so do we now put a strip here for these to slide into? Is that what happened? Yeah, so this one got deleted when we ripped this down to reroute those. Gotcha. Because once you take one section out, you have to start at one end and move all the way to the other. So if you want to get to this middle section, you have to take this end out and get to there. Gotcha. Which I'm not willing to do. Again. Again. Yeah. I'm just happy for whenever we use this trailer that, don't get me wrong Tim, I'm glad you brought them when we were snowmobiling the little posts to walk around to hold the insulation oh, yeah. up, but it's like hunched over, trying to knock a, not, not knock a post over. Okay, Sammy, for every record, Vinny and I didn't knock any posts over. <laughs> it is him. We bring Paul over and he <laughs> knocks every fucking post down. What That's surprising. Points. It's my noggin. It throws me off balance <laughs> a lot. See, look at that. You ever seen me run the ball? <laughs> you barely even know that it's not stock. Shitty up here. Yeah, you wouldn't even know. Just a need to come. Yeah, exactly. And, and, no. Yeah. That's it. Right, this, is, this, is our, this is our proof of concept round two. Lights are finally all cleaned up. We don't look like a bunch of jerk offs. Lights are good. Um, tucked away, clean. Yeah, you can kind of see them, but they're LEDs. They're way brighter than uh, incandescents or whatever. And uh, it's pretty bright in here, so it's, that's nice. Um, AC is hooked up. Uh, basically, got everything except for that zone controller put in. That'll be here tomorrow. We're gonna get that in Thursday night. I'm gonna do some cleaning. And then we're gonna go to Sandy. Okay. Then we're gonna go to Okay. Then we're gonna go to Sandy. So not bad. Solid work. All right, so the AC unit is in. It's pumping, it's kicking out nice cold air. As you can see over here, Paul get out of the fucking way. <laughs> Sitting at 69 degrees. We have it set for 68, but it fluctuates between 68 and 70. Um, it's a great unit, but obviously it's not perfect. I mean, we're in a trailer, but uh, all set up. So we just got here at Silver Lake Sand Dunes. So uh, we're going to have a blast tomorrow. So if you want to see us at the Sand Dunes, go ahead and subscribe to the channel so you can see the next episode. Once again, I'm Video with Caswell Customs. This is Brent. Paul, we'll see you in the next one. You stole